We are a generation who loves God. We are a generation who trusts in God. We will always hope in God. Greetings in the wonderful name of Jesus. It is Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez here and I'm so happy to be with you today. It is a brand new day that God has given us. It is a day to live to the fullest. It is a day to press on. It is a day that we should press on and we should not give up. Our God loves us. Our God is good. Our God is gracious. Our God is merciful. And He will not give up on us. And therefore, we must not give up on Him. God is good. And He wants you to prosper. He wants you to succeed. He wants you to be highly favored as His children. Today I want to pray for you special prayers for the favor of God to be on your life even in the season. So wherever you are my dear friend let us begin by welcoming the Holy Spirit. I welcome you right now to lift up your hands along with me as a sign of surrender and say this out loud with me. Say Holy Spirit of God I welcome you. Come Lord Holy Spirit and take over control. Help me to pray. Help me to press in and help me to receive from the Father today. I ask this in Jesus' name, and I thank you for it, Lord. Amen. My dear friend, let us go straight into a time of prayer. I discern the presence of God, and I know, I trust, I believe God is going to bless you. The Bible says, enter his gates with thanksgiving and enter his courts with praise, and we will do just that. Wherever you are, begin to praise and thank God in your own words. Father, thank you. Thank you for another day that you've given us, a wonderful day, a day that we can live to the fullest a day that we can press on, a day that we can receive from you. We give you praise and we thank you for your goodness and your mercy towards our lives. We can make it because you have made a way for us to make it. We can press on because you have made a way for us to press on. We can receive blessing after blessing simply because you have made a way for us to receive that blessing. We thank you and we give you praise even today for the blessing that makes rich and adds no sorrow. We thank you that you never leave us helpless, you never leave us alone. And we trust you. We put our trust and our hope in you. We know that as we trust you, you will make a way for us. The best place that a born-again believer can be is in your presence, in the secret place of the Most High. We give you praise and we thank you for this. That as we dwell in your secret place, it shall be well with us. It shall be well with our families. It shall be well with everything that concerns us. It shall be well with our purpose and our destiny. It shall be well with our finances. We give you praise and we thank you, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen and Amen. My dear friend, I discern God's presence. And I know, I trust, I believe as we pray today, as we go into a time of prayer, as you connect in faith, God will bless you. God will touch you. God will heal you. God will lift you up to a greater glory. God will favor you, even as we pray special prayers for favor. Believe and trust God for His divine favor on your life. Now, as I begin to pray for you, I want to encourage you, comment down below in the comment section and agree with me. There is so much power in agreement, and even as you comment and agree, God is going to bless you. But in saying that, let us begin. Father, I pray for my dear friend, even today, surround my dear friend with favor as with a shield. Father, I pray in my dear friends going out and in my dear friends coming in. Protect my dear friend and favor my dear friend, my dear friend who has tuned in and is watching this video. Father, I pray in the mighty name of Jesus. Do what only you can do. In all areas of my dear friend's life, bless my dear friend mightily. Let your favor be evident on the life of my dear friend. Open doors of blessing. Doors of promotion. The blessing that makes rich and adds no sorrow. Promotion that comes without any baggage and without any condition. Father, I pray that you will bless my dear friend mightily. As you favor my dear friend, in your eyes and in the eyes of people around, 
Father, I pray that you will open doors, open opportunities, where my dear friend may be concerned that things are not going so well. I pray that you will settle things, begin to put things in place, begin to bring divine order and divine alignment. Bring divine alignment in my dear friend's life and bring things in order wherever things have not been going the right way. Father, I pray that you'll intervene. Wherever my dear friend has a business, an opportunity in work, an opportunity in a certain career field, an opportunity to do something that you have called them to do, I pray that you will surround my dear friend with favor as with a shield. I pray that your grace I pray that your grace that is sufficient for us will be around my dear friend and through your grace make a way by the grace available in Christ. Father, I pray for my dear friend wherever my dear friend needs a miracle, wherever my dear friend needs a sign or a wonder, wherever my dear friend needs divine intervention, wherever my dear friend needs a fresh touch from you. Father, I pray that you will do what only you can do. Intervene divinely. Bless my dear friend mightily. Take my dear friend up from glory to a greater glory. Do what only you can do in my dear friend's life. Wherever my dear friend needs divine deliverance, bring complete deliverance, complete freedom, freedom from all demonic attack, Freedom from all witchcraft attack. Complete freedom. I ask this in the name of Jesus. I thank you that right now your power is going forward. And you are moving. You are doing something. You are doing something great and something wonderful. And you are impacting and influencing the life of my dear friend. Father, I pray. Give my dear friend grace and favor that my dear friend will grow closer to you, that my dear friend will experience what it means to serve the God who speaks and he lives. As my dear friend calls unto you, show my dear friend great and mighty things which my dear friend knoweth not. As my dear friend seeks you, bring divine intervention in my dear friend's life and bless my dear friend mightily. Right now, I thank you for favor so much favor. I thank you for the blessing that makes rich and adds no sorrow. I thank you that right now miracles are happening. Your presence is in this place. Your anointing is in this place. And divine restoration is taking place. Restoration from head to toe. Restoration in terms of all those things that was stolen from my dear friend. I thank you and I give you praise in Jesus' name. Amen and Amen. My dear friend, God is with you and God is able to do great and mighty things. All things are possible for those who believe. Continue to believe in God and you will see His divine, wonder-working power. From myself, Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez, we've come to the end of this video. I will see you again soon. Until then, shalom and goodbye. Thank you for watching. If you were blessed by this video and you would like to support us to keep making content like this, you can do so via PayPal or Patreon. The links are provided in the description. God bless you and goodbye.